Welcome to another movie. As you can see, this time I have a charger. So, uh, this is my normal charger that I'm using. It's quite dirty because it's laying on the floor mostly. Uh, I'm using a Toniji Accucell 6. It's the uh, very old uh, charger, quite old. It's the same as a um, I, uh, B6. Uh, if I remember chargers, of course I have a uh, temperature sen sensor for uh, measuring the battery um, temperature of course I have many adapters like you can see in here I have a uh, let me try to take it out X uh, XT60 to DNT just to use the same uh, cable uh, it's uh, charging if I remember up to uh, Yes, uh, 6S and it's working fine for me but uh, because uh, I'm getting uh, many and many more models now I need to have a little better and uh, uh, more advanced charger that's why I buy this one it's a HDRC and from all those false, uh, four models I have the T20 uh, 240 duo charger it means that I can charge two batteries in same time there are two batteries that uh, can do that and the difference between this one and this one and same between this one and this one is that this charger is just a charger like this uh, uh, and the second one is uh, with the uh, LCD uh, touchscreen and that's the difference so uh, this is uh, similar to that one but uh, of course it's uh, much better have new firmware and stuff like that and this one uh, is the same one as uh, this but just uh, have two uh, models uh, like that one and this one uh, just have a LCD screen and also can send I don't know if this one can but this one can send uh, statistics uh, to a uh, uh, PC about the battery so this will not be any technical uh, review I will not test any voltage amps stuff like that I will not open I just want to show you uh, what uh, do I have in uh, now let me see some uh, languages of course not Polish <laughs> uh, here are some spe uh, specification I don't know if you will be able to see it quite good but let me see I have uh, this one uh, 100 uh, to 240 uh, volts uh, of input AC DC is 11 to 18 so you can uh, power it from a car or to a lipo uh, AC input uh, first and uh, second channel 100 watts DC input blah blah, blah not interesting charging current from 0.1 to 10 amps uh, on both channels uh, separately uh, 0 uh, 1 up to 2 amps uh, for discharge can charge uh, lipo uh, li low I don't know this one life and Li uh, HV also I don't know this one mostly I have a lipo and uh, the ion, I think it's the uh, li low is the ion, but have no idea. I did never see that. NCD, NMH, uh, PB, smart battery. Uh, hmm, how to say? Uh, how to say what is that? And some dimensions. Uh, in here, what do we have? Is uh, display, uh, of course, uh, basic information and many. Uh, lithium battery balancer, maximum safety, power uh, disruption, uh, terminal voltage control, battery metal, piece of link. Okay, so as you can see, I did open that uh, already because I wanted to see it. <laughs> it's well packaged, I can tell you that. As you can see, everything is separated. Here we have the charger. Here we have probably many cables and a power adapter some worries oh sorry it's built in <laughs> let me take it 
this to the side. Uh, yes, it's built in. Okay, so uh, uh, luckily I got a, uh, a clover leaf power cable with the Polish plug <laughs> or European plug as as you wish. So it's uh, oops, it's directly it's built in power adapter. Uh, you have a, a input power from a. Uh, if I remember, I remember 3S or, uh, or 4S uh, battery, so you can uh, charge it uh, in the field. Of course, you have um, standard uh, battery connection, uh, balancer connection, uh, temperature sensor. I will need another sensor uh, for the second battery if I will need it. Mostly, I don't use it, but if I have a battery that uh, I'm not sure if uh, it's working and uh, if it will not overheat and maybe burn and uh, then I connect the sensor just to be sure uh, it's uh, it's safe we have a piece of link in here another piece of link I think it's uh, for separated uh, charges that's quite weird but uh, two piece of links of course I found to cool it down and actually that's all uh, let me take this out also we get and that for uh, we have uh, we have a uh, battery uh, 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 cable for powering the device from a battery uh, you can uh, use some uh, not no 20 volt um, uh, maybe car battery but it's quite small uh, or maybe from a uh, battery from a UP UPS, I don't know, lead free, I don't know how, what battery types are that, but we will not use it. Uh, you get uh, DIN T cables, two, and uh, adapters. Wait, it's the same as I have. <laughs> I did the same thing. <laughs> As I, I did, but in the uh, other way because I have a uh, XT60 on the cable and DNT on the other end, and they have it <laughs> reverse it. Uh, so this, and you get this. This is quite nice because you can always replace it. Does the balancing port uh, uh, power board? I don't know how they call it. Uh, I think that's like this. Uh, so uh, this uh, plugs are dedicated for the battery so when I take a 2S uh, battery I connect it in here when I take a 3S battery I connect it here and so on and that's uh, how the charger detecting uh, each cell of the battery and uh, charge it uh, separately so that's uh, what this board is, of course there are two like that. Uh, this one is for the second channel. Oh, it's no matter because they are the same. Okay, so give me a minute, I will connect it to the power and we will see what uh, we have in here. A few moments later. Okay, so I connected uh, everything. Uh, of course, uh, red to red, black to black. Uh, never uh, connect battery first, always connect uh, cables first because if you short uh, both plugs the battery may uh, burn or may explode, that's most important, uh, just leave this cable uh, on the charger. Of course you cannot uh, put uh, these two plugs reverse, this one can but it's uh, marked with the color. Uh, I have the, uh, mm, uh, the balancer uh, board. Uh, connected in here, I connected uh, Avanti uh, to a uh, battery on one uh, channel with the uh, XT60 and I connected my uh, Zop Power uh, also 3S uh, battery uh, with the 3S uh, plug in here and the adapter with the XT. Uh, so let me try to set it so you can see clearly we are turning it on it's not loud you can uh, hear a slightly buzz and I think that's mostly from the electronic not from the uh, fan itself 
Uh, okay, so we have uh, uh, Lilo Life Life uh, PB is the uh, the battery that I uh, talk about. This one, if I if I remember. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's see the settings first. Uh, public settings, buzzer volume. I want it to be off, and just because my dog uh, is afraid of uh, those beeping buzzers, that uh, that's why I'm always turning it off. Balance speed. Uh, let's set it to normal. Uh, AC power. Hmm. I'll also set it to normal. Uh, I doesn't have connected uh, uh, sen uh, the temperature sensor. Capacity cutoff is not important uh, now because I'm using two lipos. Uh, that's mostly if you are using uh, knee CD or knee MH batteries. Uh, as far as I understand, sorry, I'm I'm not a professional, so I may uh, mm, tell something wrong, but this is how just how I understand it. Uh, timer will set as is. Everything is here the same. Save settings. Monitor. So now it's uh, showing me that it's uh, 37 uh, percent on first cell. 55 on second uh, cell and 38 on the third uh, cell, uh, first uh, cell, and on the channel two I can uh, select separately monitor, and this one is mostly charged is uh, 78, uh, 77, and 70. So both uh, batteries are not uh, balanced. Uh, as they should, I can, uh, as you can see, I can balance it, uh, balance uh, battery in here directly on the monitor. I don't know what this is. I are checked, so I have no idea. Sorry, but I did not read the instruction. We man doesn't read it. Uh, memory, you can store uh, batteries that uh, you want uh, with current and everything. Uh, so I can uh, store uh, batteries like I have about uh, I think uh, three batteries like this and I can store it and just uh, uh, select one on each channel and probably the same one and it will charge it. Okay, so let's go into uh, channel one, the LiPo, we have a battery cell uh, 3S, do I have it? So it's automatically detected it's uh, 3S and voltage is 490 or 20. Hmm. Okay, I will set it for 20. Uh, charge current is uh, 4.3. No, this one is uh, uh, 3 amps. So if you have, uh, as far as I understand, if you have a 300, 3000 uh, uh, battery, you set it to 3 amps. So, it, uh, so let's say if this one have 1,500, uh, you set it to one and, a half, uh, one and a half amps. So in this moment we set it to uh, three amps, uh, and we can save it. Uh, why not? Oh, so I can select where I want this one, save, and I have it set in here. Okay, I will not do that now. Uh, we have a storage, we have charge, balance charge, and discharge. So for uh, balancing only, you have it in here. Let's see. Yes, now you can hear it. It's pushing a lot of air now. I don't know if you can hear me right, but we'll set it just to see how fast it will balance it.
six hours later. Okay, so after five hours of uh, trying to balance this battery, uh, I just cancel it because probably it's just uh, too, too big and I will just need to uh, discharge it a little bit and charge it again or just charge this battery to balance it because uh, that just took <laughs> a long time. So I connected this small battery, it's a 2S850 uh, uh, and I uh, put it in the store uh, and as you can see it did finish, uh, the battery was actually discharged so it uh, didn't uh, do anything in here. Uh, I can check the cells, it's not uh, balanced so because it's a small battery I think I can uh, let's see this one back I think I can uh, balance this one this one should uh, do that much faster and on the second channel I connected the giant ZOP uh, battery it's 5500 uh, milliamps uh, milli uh, amps per hour, sorry, <laughs> milli amps. Uh, and as you can see, the temperature of the device uh, uh, rises. Uh, it was uh, 33, if I remember. Uh, you have the input uh, voltage, you have the voltage of the battery, it's uh, 12.59. Uh, uh, Current now is uh, 0 0.6. Uh, amps because it's uh, probably finishing the charge capacity that uh, charge in, uh, into the battery is 1140 uh, 50 milliamps uh, per hour uh, and, and as you can see there is a uh, how to say it a, a diagram or a status of battery and how it's uh, charging now we can also check the cells the first and the third uh, cell is charged now it's just charging the, the middle one uh, I wonder how long this will take but probably not so long as uh, balancing the uh, Avanfi <laughs> but uh, it's, uh, it's charging now about 60 minutes but this one was uh, actually mostly charged uh, I'm charging as a spare battery when I'm uh, connecting some circuits and, and something like that uh, same as the Avanfi but Avanfi will be for uh, dedicated for one uh, car so now it's charging now this one is uh, almost finished as you can see it's uh, the same voltage now so that's uh, that problem was just uh, it's uh, a big battery so the same thing will be probably in here with balancing it will take uh, some time uh, but I can leave it uh, so it can charge I wanted to charge this one uh, but the problem is the plug because uh, it's from uh, Felium, Felium uh, RC bolt and they use some not normal plug like this one let me focus uh, I wanted to focus uh, so I uh, connected only the balancer plug, uh, plug and it not uh, show it as a uh, it show it the uh, connection break because uh, uh, the main battery is not connected so I need to just find this plugs and make a adapter like uh, I have in here this one is a mini JST I have a DMT uh, connector just going uh, to a uh, mini JST and uh, of course into the battery and the balance port so that allowed me to charge uh, I'm sorry that uh, this uh, is not a professional uh, review I did not show any uh, professional diagrams anything like that but uh, I just needed to charge to store so I don't uh, need any special functions, any special, uh, uh, I don't know, function, everything that this uh, charger can do. I need just a basic charger, but I want to charge uh, two and I want to 
see how it's uh, charging. That's a quite nice uh, uh, function of the cells are much better. I still will use probably the Tony Giacu cell, but uh, this one will be my main charger. So I will let it uh, charge because this will take some time and see you in the next movie.